amazing place. And Dad knows it. He calls him my fortress of solace. But now you're into astronomy. That's like a hobby. Jesus. Nice reference. No, really? This is the last time I think of necklace. There must have been more fragments of the meteor as well. There was there was multiple, wasn't there? There was there was like yeah. there was a meteor shower. There's tons of them. There must be more bits of kryptonite. Yeah, it, it was like it's like the flash, isn't it? Oh. Yeah. <sighs> Kim Flash, it's like the particle accelerator explosion, he's just created a bunch of weird things. Yeah. Weird things. <laughs> Incredibly weird. <laughs> I want to stream my MSC, I'm sponsored. Say there's something in the rafters. Yeah. He saw what it was. Yeah, he saw. <laughs> it was a dude. He jumped at you. <laughs> it was human. At least he used to be human. <laughs> it's, like, it's like Lost Boys. Have you seen that film? I'm not sure. Oh. Oh no. These are the kind of park end talks we needed in the Heart of Steel movie. <laughs> oh, speaking of the devil. I thought I said she wasn't in it, but now she is. Where did they find the time in school to do this? I don't know. Free time. I don't get no free time in school. Chloe, you can't even walk out your door in the summertime without being bitten by a mosquito. 
why do we have a little time with bug people? Uh, because we use certain level of toxins to cause mutation. Those endothelium tracks were all attacked by swarms. Greg did keep tanks of bugs in his room. Maybe they got sick of the view and staged a revolt. Well, according to this, I've been a very short life cycle. So if you really ask on Kafka, that's when he's in the Navy too. Looks like you're not the only one in Smallville with eyes for Lana. I think Greg's found his name. <laughs> like no we're not, we're, not gonna, we're not gonna talk about the dead body that you just found like, no I'm totally not crazy by a dead body right in front of me <laughs> follow the dirt tracks but a hundred yards back there's a trick with woods how do you know it's there we used to collect bugs there when we were kids look I want to apologize Run. <laughs> I kind of hope they can redeem that guy. What, the, the boyfriend? Yeah. Yeah. Get away from him. Greg, I know what's happened to you. I didn't know that I've been free. No, you haven't. You're slaved to your instincts. I have no rules, Mark. I eat what I want. I go where I want. And I take what I want. You're not taking her. So try and stop me. You're not the only one who's changed. <laughs> In reality, there's no way he should be able to even shift him. Uh. What's he doing running away? I'm trying to lift it. No. See if he's okay. No. I wonder if he got out though with the, like he shifted into a bunch of bugs and he just ran off. I don't know. Perhaps. All right. So that was odd. Pretty bloody odd. It was creepy. Yeah. It was very creepy. I feel sorry for Lana. I really do. Yeah. She has. Four, well, she had four of the, wor the weirdest people around after her. Well, only three now. There was a guy who videotaped her, a guy who looks at her for a telescope, and a, a guy that she caught her dickhead boyfriend, and then there's Lex who just acts weird. <laughs> just the way he acts when he yeah. talks to people is really creepy. But that bug, that bug guy was creepy. He was cringy as well. When he's, when he's jumping across the things in that last fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it uh, was so weird. <laughs> yeah. Lex holding on to the crypts that didn't last long. I thought that would be something he had for the rest of the series, but... Yeah. No, give him back in the next episode. No, she has it back, and he's yeah. going to still be... Like ill around her now because she's oh, yeah. wearing it and stuff. Yeah. 
That's why he didn't want to give it her back. It was because she'd be wearing it and he wouldn't be able to talk to her again. Yeah. But either way, in the end he gave it back because it's hers and he should give it back. But hopefully this reaction was a lot more lively than the a lot more lively than the first one because I recognise that the first one it was lacking two things. One was an intro and two was life. <laughs> but this show a lot of the times it's just you know drama and dialogue and stuff there's not really a lot you can comment yeah. on I know I've, I've heard it gets really crazy later on but yeah. so far like we're on the first season uh, just started. Uh, as, is, as you have said it turns into one of the best TV shows of all time apparently we'll see Yeah. we'll see about that mm. we will be the judge but as of right now, I like that episode. Really like it a lot. As of, as of right now, it's just really weird. So it's, far it, this show the, is. The, the, the writing is cringy, but it was, like I said, 90s, early 2000s. Mm. People have, have had more experience since then, they know what to do. But, yeah, so, so far, so cringy. <laughs> maybe, maybe we'll get into the next episode, which is titled Hothead. So I wonder what the hell that's going to mean. It's Be- got x-ray there as well. Yeah. I guess it's x-ray vision, perhaps. Maybe. Oh, hothead. Would that mean he's heat vision? Ah, oh, maybe. Which would, be, which would be so weird if he actually did his heat vision in this fucking show. But how it looks. either way, maybe we'll get into the next episode. But as of right now, we are over and out. You saying bye? Bye. Bye. <laughs>